Seven South African students are due to leave for China under the South Africa-China Young Scientists Exchange Program. The program is part of a five-year agreement that was signed by the South African Department of Science and Technology and the Chinese Ministry of Science and Technology in 2017 to give young researchers from both countries an opportunity to share knowledge and develop skills. CGTN Zulis Jamela has more. It's the first batch of young scientists from South Africa to China to partake in this program. The program they are embarking on is geared towards promoting the development of scientists, scholars and researchers. It focuses on various scientific fields including biotechnology, advanced manufacturing, ICT systems, green technology and astronomy. The send-off of the young scientists very much represents putting into action a concrete response to the high-level guidance and instructions we have received from our leaders. So the Science Park cooperation uh, is a key priority for our country. We stand ready to, to welcome Chinese technology-intensive enterprises in, in, in South Africa to, to promote that partnership. The Young Scientists Exchange Program is jointly funded with the aim of cultivating future leading scientists by promoting the exchange of researchers between research institutes, universities and enterprises in an effort to advance research and development and produce academic papers, new patents and innovative products. To demonstrate our strong commitment of our two governments to effectively implement the important consensus reached by the two heads of state of our two countries, to deepen our cooperation in science, scientific and technological innovation. The young scientists are excited and full of anticipation. We want to pledge and uh, make our commitment that we will not be a disappointment. We will try our level best to fly the South African flag high and we hope that uh, this opportunity will uh, allow us to learn uh, from uh, distinguished uh, scientists from China uh, and also allow us to establish research collaborations that will allow our research to go forward and also help benefit our students and also benefit our country. They're relishing the opportunity to learn new skills while imparting some knowledge to their Chinese counterparts. I will be given the opportunity to do research, to assist with student supervision, um, and to co-write some scientific papers. And during these tasks, broaden my own skill set uh, and transfer some of the knowledge I possess. The majority of the successful students selected through a call issued by the National Research Foundation earlier this year come from historically disadvantaged institutions. The young scientists are joining hundreds of other South Africans who are on exchange programs in China. It is hoped that when they come back, they will bring back skills and contribute to the economic development and social cohesion here in South Africa. Yulisa Njavela for CGTN in Pretoria, South Africa.